What's going on, y'all? I'm back with another video, as y'all can see, man. Today is another, another lovely, blessed day. It's in the morning. It's like 11 o'clock a.m. Man, so I'm about to go to this spot, man, and grab me like a nice little shirt, man. I don't know if y'all ever heard of a place here in Michigan. Detroit, Michigan is called Seven Day West. I'm about to head there and treat myself by myself something to wear. You know what I'm saying? It's like when I'm looking at this camera, man, my bottom lips are black as fuck. That's because I smoke a lot of black miles, man. I'm trying to stop that shit because it's not good for you. It's not good for you at all. I don't condone it. So, I'm about to go there. I just got done playing Call of Duty World War II. I love this controller right here, man. This controller is like $64. I'm for T-Boy. I love that controller, man. That controller is just, just something about it. But you know what I hate about you know the PS4 controllers? Did I say PS3? No, PS4 controllers. They, I don't know. Maybe I be my thumbs be heavy on the joysticks, but they break easy, man. And that shit is not good. That shit is not good. I know it's dark. Hold on, bear with me. I'm about to be back in the light just in a second. That shit is not good, man. I promise you. Cause I done went through maybe four. I done went through maybe four controllers. I got my key. I don't want to lock this stuff up. I don't want to four, four PS4 controllers. And I don't know. They just fried me. And all of them was like 60 something dollars, man. All of them was like 60 something dollars. These ain't the, not, they not the plain black ones. They like, you know, special color, like bluish and red, all that good shit. You know, and I'm not trying to mess this controller up either. Man, where is the sun? Where is the sun? Man, dog, it's cloudy. But it's still a good day, though. You know? So, yeah, I'm about to head to this place called Seven Day West, man, and treat myself to something nice. You know, so I'll hit y'all back up when I get there. Yeah. What's up, guys? So I posted with the Seven Day West, and I ended up pulling up in front of this store. What's the name of it, man? Quick Match. Quick Match. Sports Quick Match. And travel. Sports and Travels, man. They got some good stuff here. It's located on Grand... What's this? Grand River and... and Greenfield. Grand River and Greenfield. So, um, yeah, man. I'm, I was going to go to Foot Locker, but I might uh, support this situation because they just opened up like two days ago. So, I got to get something out of here. Now, I see these right here. These little pumpkin boys. <laughs> these boys look dope. They look dope. It's something different, man. I'm always buying Air Force Ones playing, but... You know, I want to do something different this time, man. So I'm gonna treat myself to something different. So now I just gotta figure out which shoe I want. You know, they, they got a, a nice different kind of selection of different colors. Like, look at these right here. These boys dope. We got these right here. Man, the part of peanut butter. Peanut butter. <laughs> <laughs> that was his boy favorite. They like a peanut butter. Damn, then you got these same guy, huh? Yep, that's Death Row. No, he customized them. He pulled up with Death Row with them. That's Death Row, huh? Mm -hmm. Shit, I ain't, no, I ain't walking the nose. <laughs> no, sir. They look nice, though. Damn, these bloody reds, though. Jesus Christ. Check this out. And that's a suede uh, kind of feel, too. Like, on a, all around the shit, suede. Just Patrick like Urin. Did I say that? Mm -hmm. Used to play basketball. In 1986. 1986. Damn, them bloody reds look cold, though. Yeah, his number was 33. So yeah, I'm about to grab me some shoes up out of here, man. I get back at y'all. Alright guys, I'm back, man. So at that store, man, they got some nice shoes in there, you know, but I don't know, man. I'm not familiar with none of that stuff, man. And that basketball player, I'm not familiar with him either. So right now I'm in Seven Day West. About to grab me something nice up out of here, man. Y'all can see they got all kinds of stuff up in here, man. All kinds of stuff. Yo, look at this fur right here. Come on, man. How you doing? Look at this fur. <laughs> what? They selling fur coats. Fur coats. Yeah, man. So, I'm trying to find what I, what I specifically came in here for was a nice button-up shirt. I mean, they got good stuff up in here. I mean, look at that. Little lap. Come on, man. Born to the hustle. Born to hustle, I mean. Oh man, they got good stuff up in here. Real good stuff. You know, they got this red black history right here. It's dope, man. It's dope. 
I'm trying to talk to y'all and find what I need to find in here, but shit, it's just so much stuff in here, man. I don't even know what I want to get. I don't want a button up. I want a polo shirt. I want a nice polo shirt, not a button up. But the problem is, is that I got to look for the button up. They got some nice $20 jeans in here, all that good stuff, man. I always buy a pair of these, man. These actually come in handy. When I buy a pair of these, I always got the Tim's on and a white t-shirt. Still look good. People be like, you dress like a dope boy. I ain't no motherfucking dope boy. Just because I buy some $20 jeans and with some Timberlands and a t-shirt, that makes me, that's considered me to be a drug dealer. That's fucking crazy. But yeah, I'm going to get back at y'all, man. I got to find this shirt, man. And I'm going to show y'all the shirt after I get it. All right, y'all. So I'm back. I'm back. Unfortunately, I did not get the shoes at this uh, new place on uh, Grand River. Uh, man, they were some nice, good shoes, but I just, I'm not feeling the style, man. Maybe I'm, I just, I just wasn't feeling them, but I got me something from Seven Day West. I got me like a little tan button-up shirt and some black jeans, that's it. The Seven Day West located in Michigan, Detroit, on Greenfield and Grand River. They got good, nice quality shit. All kind of good stuff. Even this place right here, I just left. Them. You know, I mean, you walk through the door, you see the Lakers right there, you see the Bulls right there. I mean, if y'all did just see that shit, I don't know. I just don't feel like getting out doing all that shit. So now, what I'm about to do is I'm about to head to Foot Locker and just grab me some Force Ones real quick. Like I said, I would have got those shoes, but I mean, maybe next time, maybe some other time, man. Because um, I don't know, I just really wasn't wasn't feeling the style or you know that's good stuff but I just I'm just mentally when I left out the house I was already in had in mind of what I wanted already so you know I'm just um just so having to run run park right in front of this store and just just it just happened so I'm about to drive around head to Foot Locker Grab me some special shoes. I'm gonna show y'all in a brief second. Epic fail, man. Epic fail. So, the shoes that I wanted, it didn't have them in my size. So now, I'm either gonna go to another foot locker or just say fuck it. To be honest with you, I wanna just go to another foot locker. I really want those Jordans. I mean, they match the shirt. You know, but that particular color is what I want. Did I say, did I say the shoe? If I said the shoe, man, that'd be fucked up because that means I just ruined it. And then kind of be pointless for you to continue to watch the rest of the video. I'm gonna show y'all the shirt that I bought. Seven day West. I'm show y'all the shirt. I think it's dope. It's a long sleeve shirt. It's this color. And look what it say. Premium quality apparel. Made in New York. I like this shirt. I mean, it looked plain as shit, but I think it's something different because you know it's a different type of color, a color that I've never wore it before. So, and I just got some plain black pants. So now I gotta go to another Foot Locker and get me some shoes because they didn't have the size that I wanted in the shoes. They had a, a 10 and a half and a nine and a half. I need an eight and a half. I'm not about to get a nine and a half and be looking stupid. Can't do it. Can't do it at all. So let me go ahead and just shoot to another foot locker because I ain't got nothing else better to do. So I'm gonna shoot to another foot locker and I'll get back at y'all in a second. Alright, y'all. So epic, epic fucking fail. Went to the other foot locker. Dude said they had just sold the last pair like 30, 40 minutes ago. Super pissed. Super, super down. Like I feel depressed right now. You know, I could probably go to the mall, but I'm not even trying to do all that. I don't feel like going to the mall. Not on a dry ass day like this anyway. I mean, look at this, man. It's a dry ass day, man. So, oh man, I'm just, 
just gonna chuck it up, man, and I'm gonna just go back online because that's and that's what really hurts the most because when you when you go online, I mean, maybe if I would have just paid for it online, they probably would have held it for me because it literally did say online that they had one more pair left at that location on Seven Mile by Evergreen. They said they had one more pair left, and I was I should have paid for it online. Man. I should have paid for it online. But sometimes, even when you pay for stuff online, if somebody walk in that store, they'll probably still sell it to that person any damn way. Then make some type of excuse up to you saying, well, we can order you a pair of that in tomorrow or two days later type thing. And it'll be for free. You know, sometimes, man, people will do some stuff like that. But yeah, Epic Phil didn't get the shoes. And they were some Jordans. They were 13s. I really wanted them, man. They were suede, white, and gold. Suede, white, and gold, man. Suede, black, a little gold on the side, and white at the bottom. Man, it's Jesus Christ. Well, thank y'all for tuning in, man. You know, I mean, I'm pretty sure that, you know, I'll get some blow over. You know, I really wanted those shoes. But now I see how the people feel. Damn, she can take it. Jesus Christ. But, uh, yeah, I really wanted those shoes, but I can kind of understand how some people feel, man, when they want some shoes, a certain kind of shoe, and they can't get it. Like, it's, it's, it's not even just a shoe. It's just anything, period. Just a certain thing you want, and then the disappointment hits, man. It kind of how you like, man, what the fuck? Maybe it wasn't meant for me to have them. Who knows? But thank y'all for tuning in. Give it a thumbs up if y'all like it. Give it a thumbs down if it was bullshit. You know, so... You have a good day, man. Stay blessed, man. And uh, if, if y'all in the state anywhere or anywhere where it's cold, stay warm. If y'all somewhere where it's hot as fuck, stay cool.